Heads, it's Rowan again, and this is my first outfit of the day video, and uh, because this is the first in a while, I've decided to dress all nice for you, so um, let's see what I'm wearing. Change here, I decided to go into the bathroom because it's a little less of a mess in here, so I've got a uh, violet sort of a grayish violet uh, Cambriel beret uh, and I'm going to link to her um, designs in the uh, in the description no that's not going to work today oh that's no that's definitely not going to work all right uh, the brooch I got this at Joanne I think I picked it up on a clearance. So, I find a lot of cute little costume jewelry type brooches there, and I like to wear a brooch on my berets. The, um, the makeup I'm going to go through in a minute there, um, after I do the outfit. The, uh, mm. the top, I've got a cold shoulder top from, um, I got this from Target, actually. And one of the few, like, new, new pieces that I get for myself during the year. These were quite a thing, the cold shoulder tops, in the uh, mid-1990s when I was in high school. So, uh, seeing them again was, you know, a bit of a... Ooh, dear, I've got to I've gotta do something about that. It was a bit of a blast from the past for me, so I picked one up because why not? Uh, then I've got a vintage... Uh, this was marked as Vintage 1930s Velvet Cape, and I've got to make a slight repair here on one of the beads, apparently, but I know how to do that sort of thing, so it's not, it's really not that big of a, um, thing. And then I've got, eep, we've got leggings, velvet flared leggings, and the velvet boots that I got from... Uh, oh, yeah, that's just because I wore them out, um, that I got from the, uh, thrift store, uh, last week. Uh, oh, two weeks ago now. And the, the flared leggings I got at the same thrift store, I want to say about two months ago. And then there's my, uh, bondage belt without chains. Everybody loves this without the chains, but I guess you can only find the ones with the chains lately. I've had this for... Ugh, I want to say I've got I got that when I was 19, so not quite 20 years old, and I don't remember. Oh wait, no, no, I got this at the alley in Chicago. So I would have been 22. Yeah, I would have been 22 when I got this. So mm, in the area of 15 years. So I'm gonna go to the other room to go through my makeup that I'm wearing right now. Oh, I'm back with the, where did I put it? Oh, right there. So, ooh, sorry, I've been, I was sick for the last couple days. In fact, I had a massive coughing fit on the bus back home, but I seem generally recovered from that. If it resumes, I will edit this. I'm going to take this cape off. So, uh, my foundation is number seven brand, uh, Cool Vanilla, that is actually my skin tone. Um, it's the lightest one that they make. <laughs> uh, oh, Irish skin. And, of course, I always get kind of pink, you know, about halfway through the day anyway. So, um, I usually have a powder to touch up, but I don't think I brought that out with me today. Um, the eyeliner is uh, Physician's Formula Argon Wear... Uh, Kajal, they actually don't make this anymore, and when I notice, or, I think they do. I've seen on their website, the Physician's Formula website, they do have it on the website, but they don't sell it at Ulta anymore, or, so they might be discontinuing it and just asking for a full price through the web, Physician's Formula website, but I got the last, <laughs> I got some of the last of it that you could get through Ulta, like when I noticed that they weren't going to sell it there anymore, so I stocked up on that. So, um, I've also got the, uh, Argon Wear Mascara that I got a couple of when I noticed Ulta wasn't going to be carrying this line of Physician's Formula anymore. I'm also wearing the NYX three-dimensional brow to fill in my eyebrows. 
again, they are filled in, they are waxed very thin and filled in. And the uh, lip color is, it's threefold. Where's the, oh, fuck it. Uh, it's the, uh, the NYX um, matte lip liner in Alien. And then I've got their turned up lipstick in Twisted, which is almost a neon purple. The, uh, the tube is supposed to suggest neon, but it's a little duller than a true neon. And um, the uh, line through the middle is the, um, is the liquid suede creme in Oh Put It On. And that is what I'm wearing today. Uh, combined, I think, the out... So I want to say the top I got at Target. You can probably still find them at Target. Uh, I want to say this was about 25 and then thrift shop, the uh, the boots I got at the thrift shop for three fifty, as we saw the other day in my um, video there. Uh, the uh, the leggings I got at a thrift shop for I want to say five dollars. The Cambriel hat I got this on a name your own sale um, she was doing on Etsy about five years ago, um, where basically. Um, you know, to everybody watching her shop um, page on Facebook, you, uh, eep. you know, you message her with, you know, a sale price and if she thought it was fair. So I got this for 35 originally marked, I want to say, 45 So, um, so I got this for 35 The brooch was on sale for $4. And the cape, the cape actually, I got this... Through uh, through a vintage seller on Etsy for about fifty dollars after postage. So, um, but yeah, you, know, you can find a lot of capes for less than that on Etsy, and they're you know either handmade or vintage. But I specifically wanted one that old, and I had a little bit of extra money, so I figured why not. So. Um, as you can see, you can dress very lovely for not a whole lot. You don't have to spend hundreds of dollars like some outfits are. Um, again, the makeup, you know, on sale, on sale, less than $10 for these. This was on sale. I want to say this was $4 on sale. The brow, this was on, definitely on sale. I got this on the clearance uh, bucket at Ulta for 3 I want to say. And this was not, so this was... I want to say seven. Um, so again, not not very much. I think the most ex I think the priciest makeup I paid for was the uh, foundation, and um, and that's you know was actually I got that with a coupon. So that was eight dollars after coupon. So enjoyed today's outfit, and I will make another video for today. So I was going to do the um, another gothic-themed tag video, so, alright kids, I hope to see you again. Take care, love.